Blood vessels carry blood around the body. Oxygenated blood exits the heart from the aorta and passes into the artery. The artery walls consist of three layers. The tunica adventitia is the strong outer covering which consists of connective tissues, collagen and elastic fibers. The tunica media is the middle layer and consists of smooth muscle and elastic fibers which enable it to constrict and dilate. The tunica intima is the inner layer which is in direct contact with the blood flowing through the artery. It consists of an elastic membrane and smooth endothelial cells. The hollow center through which blood flows is called the lumen. Arteries split into smaller vessels called arterioles and eventually into capillaries which are the smallest blood vessels. Unlike veins and arteries, the main function of capillaries is not transporting blood. They are specially designed to allow the movement of oxygen, carbon dioxide and other nutrients to and from the surrounding tissues. Capillaries have very thin walls comprised only of endothelial cells. This allows substances to move through the cell wall with ease. Veins are blood vessels that carry deoxygenated blood back to the heart. Capillaries drain blood into very small veins called venules. These merge into larger vessels and eventually into veins. The structure of veins is similar to that of arteries, again consisting of three layers. The tunica adventitia is the strong outer covering. The tunica media is the middle layer consisting of smooth muscle and elastic fibers. This layer is thinner in veins than in arteries. The tunica intima is the inner layer which is in direct contact with the blood flowing through the vein. It consists of smooth endothelial cells and a hollow center called the lumen through which blood flows. Veins also contain valves that prevent backflow of blood and aid venous return. For more information or to test yourself with our interactive quizzes, visit teachpe.com.